the quest thing. What's up, YouTube? HPJ here, and I'm coming to you guys today uh, just to give you a proper video of my rank 500 um, oversight. I do apologize for the tail end of that live stream because I fell asleep. I'm sorry, my schedule is just bananas. So it, I didn't have time to really properly do anything that I wanted. But we are back today and I can properly record and do my 500 rank video um, oversight. So just for a big oversight, I'll just show off uh, my degrees of difficulty. Uh, I'm not going to go into them. I think it's just pretty obvious that a lot of these are just done to show off a lot of what you've done in the game over your expand of being part of the game. Uh, just a few more things that I just really need to finish up. Don't worry, I'll finish them very soon. I think with the exception of one thing, and that's um, getting... Uh, what was it? What was it? Not this, because I have this. Um, oh, I'm trying to think. Crowns. I'm not going to get crown. I've, I've come to that conclusion. I'm not getting the crown. There's no ranked dungeon that I've ever completed, and I've gotten high enough to ever get a crown. So unless the game dies out, unless the players leave, I'm not getting the crown. Um, and that's pretty much just the synopsis of like where I am with uh, my quest. Like, I don't have a crown, and I'm not looking into trying to force myself to get a crown. Um, especially when I can't, in my own capabilities, I can't do dungeons um, like everyone else. So I'm not even going to go there with all that. But in long term short, I'm not, I'm not going to get a crown. I'm not going to see a crown unless the dungeon becomes super easy. And by some sheer coincidence, I top like the five percentage. And that's not. I don't know how that's possibly going to happen for me, but it's just not. And I'm okay with that. Um, in other news, uh, the sins are... Oh, the normal dungeons are all six stamina. Oh, I don't know if I need to farm any, because I don't need... Unless I need farming material, I just wait till Saturday and get the... Um, hit up the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday... The Thursday... Uh, ah! The Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday... Friday dungeon and get all my stuff there. Um, so yeah, I have all of that. Uh, we have November quest up now. We have uh, up the Coliseum, and I finally did beat uh, Bipolar Goddess One. Surprisingly, I still can't believe I beat it. I beat Bipolar Goddess One. I still need to beat two and three, and then I'll have access to all three of the. Bipolar, all the arena set up. I have Coliseum already, but I'm not doing Coliseum. So, um, in terms of the box, let's look at the box. Um, what's pretty much my box? Uh, I organized it by favorites, and then the favorites are organized by attribute. I think you can also automatically organize it by attribute. Um, just leave out all of the, um, evolution materials and stuff, so... But, yeah, um, this is pretty much my box. Some key stuff here to just to point out. Uh, I have a number six. Uh, I have a lot of dragon bound dragon callers that I did save up. I have Aria. Um, I have a gemstone princess from Valentine's Day in the form of carrots. I have, uh, Krish I have regular Krishna. I have, like, three awoken Krishnas. And I'm really just going to drop them to two. Because I have a regular Krishna, and I have a Woken Krishna, and that's really much all I need. Um, uh, Minerva, uh, Amino, uh, Red Athena, uh, two Hades, no, not two Hades, two Ra, which, um, I remember using these Ra's as, a farming, farming fodder, um, at this point. Got a couple of nuances in the form of Antares, one of the uh, mechanical star gods. Um, so that's three out of five now. I just need the water and the... Um... No, I only missing one because I have water, wood, light, and dark. Because I have Castor, I have Pollux, I have Astral, and I have Spica. So yeah, I'm only missing one uh, 
Mechanical Star, and I think that's the water one, which is on the other account. <sighs> so irritating. Uh, two forms of Uriel. Um, Ronya. I have two forms of Ronya, actually. And I really, all we're really missing is a Mega Wilkin form of Ronya, and I'm sad. I got a lot of wa I had a few water. I don't have a lot of water. I need water and wood are pretty much my least attained colors. Uh, I do have, of course, my cat, my uh, weatherlight captain, Giora, standing beautifully. I mean, one of my most prominent leads at this point in the game. A uh, 7x6 ward leader, the 10 combo awakening. She has ability to heal bind immunity and awoken skill bind immunity. Um, uh, ah. She has the ability to unbind your, ca your cards, which is great. And then she gives everyone a haste. Um, got a lot of one of here and there, because I'm not going over to this, but I will go over Sarah Svati, who I have in reincarnated form. She looks so pretty. She lo she does. She really looks a lot, um, a lot better in her reincarnated form. I I'm not saying that her other forms were bad. It's just similar to Krishna in terms of artwork. I love Sarasvati's current artwork in the form of this Sarasvati, but not in the form of uh, like original Sarasvati. But if I do roll another Sarasvati, I'm gonna make her the other form so that way I can have uh, both versions of Sarasvati. Um, I got my Blue Hunter, which he ain't doing nothing. He's just sitting there. Uh, Ochi. Which is nice to have. Oh, I said I wasn't going to go through everybody. Yeah, I'm not going to go through everybody. Um, there's Spekka. Uh, Fujin. Who I didn't want to talk about. Because I'm happy I have Fujin. And I'm getting Fujin ready and everything. So I can use Fujin again. Um, as one of my leads. Uh, there's uh, Liu Bei. And the Liu Bei squad. There is my... Uh, one of three of my... Uh, or those MP dragons that I purchased. Uh, I don't think I'm going to work on a four. Because I don't need a Ragnarok. I don't care for Yomi Dragon. And Neptune Dragon's trash. So. Yeah. Which is funny. Because regular Neptune is decent. Has a lot of HP. Um, very little recovery. And even a lot of descends. That's like the di most difficult boss for a lot of first time players. Um, and just pretty much a big wall in a lot of later dungeons and a lot of uh, challenges as well. Um, I do have a lot of cards here. I'm not even gonna lie, but I wanted to point out some of the big ones. Got another gemstone princess in the form of camo. Um, I did roll from my 100 stones and got two Zila. So I got regular Zila here, who's uh, everyone was two, was it two? Uh, 297 max all their skills awoken you just need to skill uh, they have their awakening skills but they don't have all of their uh, skills maxed out that's up to you uh, which luckily enough they gave us a whole bunch of stuff to do that but I'm gonna have fun with Zila I feel I think Zila's gonna be one of my most useful monsters um, and I can easily make a team with Zila and see how far Zila goes as a lead. And luckily enough, I do have a new space now, thanks to being ranked 500. So I'm going to take advantage of Zila and see what Zila can do. There's all the light cards I have. Lord Jesus. This, like, this entire box is more light and dark than it is wood, fire. And, actually, no, take that back. It's more of wood, wood and, I mean, fire and light than it is the other attributes. Um... And even my dark favorites isn't too... Oh, no, it's just as big as light. So, light, fire, and dark are pretty much my big ones. Uh, is this my? Oh, yeah, that's mine. I did roll her. No, I didn't roll her. I beat um, uh, her her middle descent, and she dropped. It took a while. Ugh. Not even going to go through there. I got a decally. Love her artwork. She's so beautiful. Um... Any other key factors point? Oh, Dark Ratatron, uh, Kami, uh, Kami, uh, as well. There's just a lot of little stuff here. Another MP purchase. One of my highest MP purchases. Dark Athena. 
I still haven't fully evolved Dark Athena because trying to get a fully evolved Dark Athena, I need the, um, I need to beat the Descend that has the material in it and turn the material into egg, and it just hasn't been working out for me, so. Um, same thing in the same situation with Miru, where I have her, she's not fully evolved, um, but I have her, and her fully evolved is animated, I also believe, so. Yeah, it's just a lot of things. Um, cotton, if I'm going to go back up, just to show off a lot of things. Got, I at least got a cotton. I don't have the cotton everyone wants to have, uh, which is the actual cotton. And then just, you know, spam through her forces to, um, you know, whichever, depending on which team you want to put her on, it determines her color. Uh, kind of similar thing with Nay, because I do have Nay. Uh, I think I just have one Nay. I know I have two names. I have uh, the original Black Nay, the original Dark Attributed Nay, who has a second skill, a team he, a team RCV and voice. So, uh, hold on. Okay, sorry about that. Um, wait, it might pop up. Give me one second. Okay, I'm back. So, yeah, let's just scrolling back up um, to talk about some more cards since I have all this time to talk about them. Uh, Shiva Dragon, who's here. Uh, Shiva was my first of my MP dragons. I think Shiva was the first one I purchased. Uh, Shiva did help in a lot of decisions, but just overall in time, I think just the MP dragons aren't strong enough like they used to be. With the exception of Odin Dragon. Uh, I don't have Neptune because Neptune's trash. Uh, I have Ra Dragon. Who's a little above trash. But the Ra Dragon team itself fell apart. Because it's just... You need a lot of stuff on Red Dragon team. You need... Kami. You need Kami. Ah, Kami. You need Kana. You need... Um, Isis, which I do have. And Decali. Let me find Ra Dragon. But it's so much work just to go from little Rod Dragon all the way to this big one. And uh, if it wasn't for that special that special event uh, this month, I mean this year, where the quest dungeon was um, picking up pieces of your, all the little pieces that could make your MP dragons, and then them giving you the 300 monster the 300,000 monster points to buy an MP monster or to save it up for later purchase of an MP card, I wouldn't have gotten um, this Rod Dragon evolved. I still need a lot of pieces on this Rod Dragon. Um, I actually would rather just have a whole bunch of time extends than the HP, um, the HP up, the HP, the attack and RCV up actually can stay. But I'd rather it be more of a um, of time extend because everything else in its, its move setup is pretty much great. Um, but yeah, the almighty god Rod Dragon is not as almighty as he used to be. Um, and I got a lot of my favorites just overall in this game. Um, when it comes to just what I have and what I've gone, what I've gotten over the early, the last five months, or last 150 days, which, uh, I'm trying to accumulate how much is, how many, like, legit days is that, um, because I have to use a calculator and I don't feel like it, but, um, teams, teams, let's go over teams, I have a lot of teams, uh, whether they range from farming teams, like this one with, um, Ganesha, or you have your Lube farming teams, or you just make a shape, make a, a mishmash team shape up, like this one with Rod Dragon. Just use all the forms of monsters who can inflict damage to your opponent without having to touch them, and just go from there. So it's a lot of skill boost too, which is great because I don't think Sunburst. I don't think Ra has Sunburst Knuckle ability. Has changed off that much. I think it's still like. Yeah. Seven turns. They're all sitting at like a two times. Skill boost. 
So yeah, they're perfectly fine here. Um, I have two forms of cotton. Okay, so I think one of these cottons is going to be like, um, is going to be Zila. Just because I could get the Zila team together. And it's going to be regular Zila. Because um, the other form of Zila, I, I don't really care too much for. So. Yeah, I'm going to have my regular Zila lead for right now until I get the other Zila together. So when she becomes max level, uh, that Zila will take over. <laughs> As uh, may. Just because I'm going to use the evolution for Zila, Zila Evo. Probably something else. I mean, it has a follow up attack though. Why this one has. I think this is going to be the sub, and the other form of Zila is going to be the lead. Which is fine. Because I have two Zila. So it really doesn't really matter to me. Um. Raw team. Uh, there's, there's, there's the Athena team. The only reason why I didn't have Loki is because I don't have Loki. Uh, there's Raw Dragons. Uh, I know I have the extra slot, but that's just really there. Fujit. Who looks great. Cotton, who looks great. Um, because that's my Cotton team. That's my, um, what is you? Ganesha. Uh, and then I have my Giora team with Giora, Kali, Fujin, Yurd, and... Rock Dragon. Pretty much, I got two board changers. I got someone to deal with void damage, um, the void damage situation, and then just, just yep, yeah, Jora with her powers and her 7x6 board. Um, I have a lot of 7x6 board leaders, it's just I'm very picky about which ones I use. Um, but team stats are awesome on this end, so I'm not complaining. Uh, where, where am I at now in time? Oh, I just hit the 17 minute mark. So, yeah, I'm pretty much getting set here. So, um, if you guys have any questions about teams and stuff, let me know. Because I'll be doing a team building video. Um, actually using Giora as, I mean, not Giora, but using a lot of the newer cards I have um, to set up stuff. Um, really get a feel of things and just overall look at the sins and stuff um, at some point in time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm really enjoying the five the 500 rank video, um, and then just going from there. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comment section below, or uh, with, or you can respond to me to one of my many social media links. Uh, I just added a Instagram, as well as I do have a Discord, so you guys can follow me on can talk chat with me on Discord. Uh, Still have my Facebook page, my groups and stuff. So, yeah, if you guys want to chat, uh, ask some questions, go right ahead and feel free to link yourself to one of my many social media groups and uh, outlets, and I can talk to you there. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Uh, kind of need to stretch it, not stretch this video any longer than I have to. So I will talk to you guys next time. ACJ, signing out. Take care.